Hey folks, welcome back to Merton Hyundai and Ed's Garage. It of course is Edward here and today we are doing a feature review on something a little different. This is a Lincoln Town Car. Uh, now this one happens to be a 2005 Lincoln Town Car, um, but as it is a Lincoln, it's actually got a lot of features and I'll go over those with you. I'm making this video for a gentleman by the name of Mike. Thank you so much for your inquiry, Mike. Um, hopefully I'll see you here and we can go over the car together, but for now, Here's some of the cool things about this 2005 Lincoln Town Car. All right, so starting on the front, of course, you've got the beautiful Lincoln grille right below the uh, the hood ornament. They still got the little bendy hood ornament. That's kind of cool. Very traditional styling look on the front there. This one does have 17-inch uh, aluminum alloy rims, and it has the key code entry, which is kind of cool. Now this is the apparently the Signature Limited, so one of the higher trim levels. I think it may actually be the top trim level. You can see it's got the backup sensors on the bumper there. Now Mike, this one, this is for you specifically. Um, this vehicle is in pretty good shape, however it does have some bruises. Uh, you know, it's not without its faults. Um, being an older car, obviously it's going to have some things. Now, a lot of this is going to get polished out. It hasn't actually gone through detailing yet. So I would surmise that this, from about here to here, probably won't be visible, any, visible anymore. You might see a little bit here. And then this is probably going to go as well, but you'll probably see this down here as well still. Um, this is pretty deep here, but this is not. This is. This is not. So this is going to be quite a bit reduced. Um, to the point where it won't look so bad. You won't really notice it as much, but it is there. On the front of the bumper, we have another little scrape right here as well. So keep that in mind. Uh, and it looks like a bit of a paint chip there too. All right, so let's go over some of the features here. Now, most of the features, of course, are gonna be on the inside. So we do have power heated seats and the cool thing is just like a Mercedes S-Class they put the uh, the adjustable power options right on the door here you've got memory seating and mirrors for two people heated seats as well and of course your power windows locks and mirrors all controlled here on this nice little wood interior pattern a little bit of wear on the handle there now, let's see how does this work there we go a little storage compartment in the armrest I love this, the wood trim on the steering wheel. We do have um, controls for your cruise control here and for your stereo, so you've even got temperature control, which is kind of cool. Adjustable pedals, okay, so that changes the distance by uh, where the pedals are. Beautiful leather interior, it's actually in pretty good shape as well. There's, uh, I don't see any rips here anywhere. So typical wear on the leather, but it's actually in very good condition for the age. Center console storage. All right, so that is broken. All right, so there's a problem there. A little, little bit of a broken. Looks like it's missing a pin here. Oh, I see. That's interesting. It actually opens up both ways. Weird. Okay, so that's broken. When it's down, it's fine. Okay. Going to the back. So we got the ashtray, little folders in the rear in the rear of the seats. It does have rear vent controls, center cup holder armrest. We'll have a look in the trunk. Oh, that's not the trunk. <laughs> it's the gas door. Shows you what I know, eh? I don't see a trunk button here, so maybe bear with me. I don't. Uh, I don't sell Ford Lincolns for a living. All right, it's on the key fob though. Yeah. There go. Okay, that's how we open the trunk. Oh, look at that! It actually opens up all the way by itself. That's cool. All right, a massive trunk, lots of space. Now this one has the little security switch. This actually will shut the fuel pump off. So if you're leaving the car for a long time, you can actually shut it off to the point where 
you simply wouldn't be able to start it. Now it has the little electronic closure there, so as you put the trunk down, it actually pulls itself shut. All right, so we have dual zone. I'm gonna turn this off here for the fan noise. Dual zone climate control, as well as of course your AM FM stereo with CD player. Now it's a six CD player, so six different CDs you can put in there. Uh, we have tilt steering. We've got an auto dimming rear view mirror. Compass right here. And here's where you can turn off your rear parking sensors. And looks like garage door buttons as well. Okay, so there you have it. There's the 205, uh, 2005 uh, Lincoln Town Car with 145,000K on it. Great shape, drives beautifully, very, very smooth on the road. Uh, engine transmission are fantastic condition. Um, just needs the detailing, and we just got to get that done still. So hopefully that works out. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to call me, 604-795-0836. And if you're watching this, uh, just to get an idea about what the town car is all about, uh, if you have any comments, don't hesitate. Leave the comments below. Thank you so much. Don't forget to hit, hit subscribe for more videos, and uh, we'll see you later. Take care.